Well, Michael, thanks very much for coming here to speak to the Oxford Guild Business Society at the Oxford Union tonight. Um, I just had a few quick questions for you. Uh, first of all, I know you've done a huge range of things during your career, and I was wondering what was the greatest challenge you faced? I, I think you, they're different. Yeah. It, cha different challenges in different jobs. I don't, I don't think I could identify one challenge yeah. that was um, bigger or dip, you know, more common to all of them. I think every job you do poses a different challenge. Definitely. And what, do you, what would you say is the best piece of advice you've been given? My parents used to tell me that it didn't matter what you did yeah. as long as you were good at it and you should do your best to be good at whatever it was. Um, and you know they used to say it really doesn't matter whether you're a whether you're a dustman or a doctor, just yeah. be good at it, do it to the best of your ability. Great. And I know you started as a lawyer. Um, what motivated you to go into politics? Well, I always wanted to get into politics. Just took me rather a long time to yeah. to get there because I I, um, I had strong views. I wanted to make a difference. I thought I um, could do things to make the country we live in, a, a better place, um, and I wanted to have a shot at that. Great. And just picking up on last night's historic um, debate of House of Commons, what were your thoughts on that? I've, I've, I agree with the, uh, with the majority vote. I will vote in the same way when the bill comes to the House of Lords, and uh, I've, so I support the change. Great. Um, what does the future hold? What are the plans for the next few years? For the country? For yourself? For me? <laughs> for me. Yourself personally? Yeah. Well, I'm um, in a quite a lucky position now. I divide my time between charities. I'm chairman of Help the Hospice, which is the umbrella organisation for all hospices in the country. And I have some business jobs. And uh, my wife and I travel quite a bit. So um, I'd like that to continue for quite a few years if I'm lucky enough to, uh, to be spared to do that. Great. And if you could do it all again from the scratch. Um, would there be anything you do differently in main particular things? Lots and lots of things, because as we go through life, we yeah. all make mistakes, and I've made lots of mistakes, um, and I try and remedy them. Definitely. Great. Well, thanks very much, Michael. Um, I'm Abbas Ghazmi, and this was an interview with Michael Hubbard. Thank you. Good.